Welcome back everybody. Today I'm going to be rendering some leaf lard. This was gifted to us from our good friend Jason when he done the hog harvest. This will be the first time that I've ever rendered lard. I'm going to be using a crock pot. Some people use a pot on the stove. Other people use um, like a pan in the oven. But I'm going to use a crock pot today. The first thing you need to do is cut your fat up as little as you can. Some people grind it up. I'm just going to chop it up in little bitty pieces. Leaf lard is the purest fat you can use. It's mostly used in pie crust, biscuits, um, pastries. It has a neutral flavor unlike your fat back that'll have a pork taste. I have my crock pot on low and as I'm cutting up the fat I just put it in the crock pot and let it start its rendering. Now I'm just going to close the lid and about every 30 minutes I'm going to come and stir to make sure it's not sticking to the bottom. This is after the first 30 minutes and you can see it's starting to render down. This is about an hour afterwards. I'm going to stir this and I've got enough to where I can strain off some. Here I have a cannon jar and a wire mesh strainer and my funnel. I'm going to put some cheesecloth on top of that and strain the lard. Now I'm just going to strain out some of the lard into the jar. Then I'll do the same thing about every 30 minutes to an hour. It'll look like this coming out, but it'll turn pure white when it cools. This was about after four to five hours. It's almost done. And here's what they look like after they're done. They turn pure white. I've already made biscuits with this and it's really good. I wanna thank Jason for gifting us the leaf lard. And I wanna thank y'all for watching. I hope you have a blessed day and come back and see us.